Hey chickies, okay today we are doing flowers for the 31 day challenge. I really hope you like it. Let's get into it. And these are the polishes I'll be using for this many, all the details of which will be in the description box down below as per usual. As you can see I've painted two of my nails white and the two middle nails are painted with INM Nails Dream On. Now these are the brushes that I'll be using, they're from Picture Polish, they're number 10 and number 2. I'll also be using my e.l.f. Cosmetics concealer brush because I love it so much. Now, in order to get it ready to do, you know, what I want it to do, I smush it onto a piece of paper, like literally treat it really badly, <laughs> just so that the bristles get really brusted, like bristly. <laughs> so first off, I'm using the e.l.f. Concealer brush and I'm basically just dipping it into a spot of white polish and then dabbing it onto the paper to get most of the polish off the brush because I want it to have a, like a mottled kind of cloudy sort of very soft textured feel. So now moving on to the flowers, I'm starting with the number two from Picture Polish which is the larger of the two brushes that I'm using and I'm using the pink and the white, mixing them together on the paper and then using the very tip of the brush to create the petals for the flower. Then adding another drop of white to create a lighter pink and then adding that to the sort of base of each of the petals. And then for the base of the flower doing exactly the same thing mixing the green and the white. And for the stem I'm just using the green neat just by itself with no white so it's a little bit darker. Then I'm going to be adding some more pink and white to the pink and white drop and using the smallest brush which is the number 10 from Pitch Polish and adding some more petals towards the back of the flower. And then repeating the whole process again for the second flower. You can put as many flowers on your, on your nail as you can fit. I've just decided to only put two. Next I'm going to be creating another marbled spot or dot or drop of polish onto my paper and using the very tip of the larger brush I'm going to add some dots in varying places around the nail just to fill in the gaps. Then moving on to the middle nail I'm going to do exactly the same thing. And once all of your flowers are completely dry, you can go ahead and top coat. I'm using Sesh Feet for this one, as per usual. <laughs> and that's it for this one. I really hope you liked it. I basically made it up as I went along. So <laughs> anyway, oh, and here is a close-up view of the flowers. And next up is Delicate Print. Hmm, no idea what I'm going to do for that. Anyway, thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, chickies. Oh, and thank you for subscribing. And thanks for that delicious thumbs up. Bye.